What is up, guys? Dipper Nation back. And, um, I'm doing something I haven't really done before, so this is my first review. I'm doing a review on Copenhagen Mint. Um, if any of y'all watch Outlaw, he made a video and it said, what the Copenhagen, this mint sucks. And he pointed out something. Let's see. I got an old Copenhagen wintergreen crayon somewhere around here. Somewhere. Anyway. And he pointed out at the bottom of it. It's like cheap plastic. And I'm sitting there, I was like, alright, maybe it's just certain cans. Because here's my Copenhagen mint can. That's the bottom of it. Now, if any of y'all had Copenhagen Mint yet, you probably noticed that the bottom, it's like a kind of weird feeling plastic, has a little, it's blue on the bottom, like the top. But no, the, um, this is like the old plastic that school and everybody has, like he said. But, um, I'm not, but... I, I have to disagree with them. This is a really good mint. I mean, I've tried a lot of mints. I had Grizzly Mint, and it's just no. I no. I all right, Grizzly Mint. It's all right. It's not everyday dip for me. No, but this Copenhagen Mint would honestly be the best dip for me. It has the mint flavor, real s strong mint flavor. You really can't taste the tobacco in it. I like it. But, um, not everybody likes it, and that's okay, because everybody's stuck to their own opinion. But, um, I, I talked to a lot of people, and they were like, yes, Copenhagen dip, Copenhagen mint is a new everyday dip for me. Like, I just got this can, maybe four o'clock yesterday, this is how much I have left. So that's how much I have left. And, uh, it's actually good for me. But, um, anyways, Copenhagen Mint. It has a, like I said, it has a real strong mint flavor, real strong mint smell. And a lot of people don't like that. Me, I'm a fan of the smell. I'm a fan of the taste. The taste like, it's kind of hard to put the dip, the mint smell, like, taste in it. Like, Grizzly, they kind of have it, but I can taste the tobacco in it, which, that don't bother me. But, um, uh, some people don't like that. This, it's, like, straight mint flavor. But, yeah, that's my opinion on Copenhagen Mint. I like it. Probably going to be a new, every I'm going to be switching back and forth between that and Copenhagen Wintergreen. Uh, I'm going to try and get, uh, I'm probably going to do a lot more reviews, so if you want me to do a review on something, put it in the comments below, and I will see you guys in the next video.